What's up everybody, it's JW, and I finally, finally, finally got back to my bank. I got one half dollar box this week, a couple nickels, a few pennies. All the pennies were uncirculated, so they went straight to eBay. Um, if you need 2020 Denver penny rolls, let me know. But this is going to be um, my half dollar hunt. What I'm going to do is check through all of this. If I do find anything, it's going to go straight back into the hunt for my live streams until I can start getting bank wrap rolls consistently. So let's get into it. I've already checked for enders. Nothing is obvious. We do have a couple uglies, but let's get into it and I'll bring you along if I do find anything. So we'll be looking for silver, anything old, 74D DDOs. If I do find any, they will go in a flip and then they will go back into the prizes for the next stream. Like I said, there doesn't look to be any enders in here. There are some nicer 70s, so we'll look at those and then we will go from there. So here we go. And here we are, roll number five. We have a piece of plastic. All right, put that on the side. Let's check right here. He got a 68 Denver 40 percenter right there. First find, roll number five. That's what I'm talking about. So right there, we got one. We will add that to the finds and we will go through the rest of these and see what we have. Putting all the 74 D's on the side, I will do a clip at the end going through all of those. See what else is in here. And nothing in that one. So here we go, let's go to the next one. Rule number six, and here we go. See if we can find some more silver. Doesn't look like it from the edge. Let's see. Oh, <laughs> right there, right there. You can see it. I didn't see it from the edge because it was so dirty. I didn't see it from the edge. You can look right here, the second bell. coin. And right there, it is a 1964 90 percenter right there that is awesome right there so we got 190 140 so far and we're only six rolls into the box let's see anything else in here come on All right, roll number seven. Let's see if we can keep on it or if we're just gonna have a couple of random silvers. I think we might have another one. Right there. And it is another one, another 1964 oh. Kennedy 90%er. Holy cow, right there. That is number two. Let's see if there's any other edges in here. This one looks questionable. It is not just a bicentennial. All right, let's keep going. Roll number 47. Is 
We might have one right now. You can see it better on the camera. But let's check. Oh, and we do a 40%er right there in 1967. Holy cow, that's the second one. That is the second one. So two 40s, two 90s so far. And we got three more rolls after this one. I want to check this one because it's really thick edged. Just a 74. All right, let's check through this one and we'll keep going on. Let's see. And that's going to be it. Let's go on to the next rolls. Come on. And here we are. The last roll of the box. Roll 50. Let's open it up. Let's see. That would be kind of cool. First roll, last roll, silver. Come on. Doesn't look like it. Doesn't look like it. Let's get through this one. 74D. I do have a substantial amount of 74Ds to go through for the final clip. So let's see. And like I said earlier, if there are any found, they will be put into the boxes when I do the customer wrap boxes for the next stream. So here we go. So these are all the 72 D's that I have to go through. There's probably, I don't know, $20 worth there. So I'm gonna go through them, see if there's any double dies, and then I will bring you back in if I find any. So here we go. So here we go, I'm gonna go through all of these to look for 74D DDOs, and if I do find anything, we'll pause and we'll look at them, but the rest of it is going to be put on fast forward. All right, so here we go. This is what we found in the box. Really, only right here is really the good finds. The rest of these, I'm just gonna check my album against and see if I can replace any, and then they will go right back into the pot. So, we did find two 90 percenters, 1964s, pretty, pretty dirty, but that's okay. They are both from Philly. So two 90 percenters, and two 40 percenters, a 67 and a 68. There we go, so not bad. Very, very cool, so happy to find them. We did find one NIFC, of course, that one will get a sticker on it when it goes into the customer wrap boxes. There's that, one little piece of garbage, so we'll throw that away. We found five bicentennials that are just in really, really good condition. Let me pull one out here that I'm going to check against my album for and see if I can replace one. If not, again, it'll go back into the box. So we'll see there. And then a whole bunch of other ones here. Uh, this really, really nice 71 that I almost guarantee will upgrade my album because it is so nice. But that thing is just, it's, it's practically brand new. So very, very cool. It's still reflective actually. So very awesome. So Thank you guys for watching. Like, share, and subscribe. I hope you like this video. And uh, I can't wait to get back to regular bank boxes. If this is anything to tell what the next ones will look like, I think we'll be sitting pretty good. So thank you guys, and we will see you guys all on the next video.